Claudia Jacobs and her husband heard the shocking news on their car radio. Her employer, the Schlecker drugstore chain, was going out of business. We were on our way to buy wedding rings. We were planning to get married that year. I heard about Schlecker's insolvency in the car. My world collapsed right then and there. Almost 6,000 Schlecker outlets in Germany were closed within a matter of months. Like Claudia, some 27,000 mainly female Schlecker employees lost their jobs. Half of them are still unemployed one year later. To make matters worse, most of the closed outlets were in rural, structurally weak areas. In places like that, it's hard to find a new job. And for women, there's the additional factor that many have family commitments and often are caregivers. That makes them less flexible for work opportunities. Claudia Jacobs was flexible and took the leap into self-employment, starting her own drugstore in Berlin. She says many of her old Schlecker colleagues are still looking for work and are just getting offers of low-paid jobs. Claudia is happy that she took her chances with self-employment. I was earning over 17 euros an hour at Schlecker. I knew I wouldn't be getting that ever again. Not in retail and definitely not as a salesperson. Not for 17 euros an hour. Self-employment was it. I just wanted to work. She hasn't regretted taking the plunge into self-employment. Quite on the contrary. For Claudia Jacobs, nothing beats being her own boss.